In tonight's Military Watch Report, part three of our series, Life Underway, taking you inside the recent deployment of the USS Dwight D. Eisenhower. The Ike is the second oldest carrier in the active fleet today, so maintenance is critical and repairs are often needed. But during this recent deployment, the crew faced a unique challenge. Due to the COVID restrictions, the ship stayed at sea most of the time, avoiding port calls. Typically, that's where repairs can be made or critical materials acquired. Instead, they were forced to design and make materials while underway and adapt to keep the mission on track. I think it, the, the uniqueness as far as the innovation that happened on this deployment is a function of um, the, the pandemic and our inability to kind of have contractors of the OEM come out here. Um, we were able to kind of find innovative ways or you know, to uh, affect some of the repairs. Uh, we were able to kind of use different kind of materials or we were able to kind of collaborate on, the, on shore with some of the people, the uh, technicians and the engineers to kind of help us out. Two of the specific major repairs made underway, fixing one of the elevators that carry aircraft. That is a job not traditionally done by sailors and certainly not at sea. Innovation also allowed the engineering department to repair the starboard rudder when it failed. That repair was done in 36 hours, far less than the week minimum had the ship needed to pull into port. On the Military Watch, Tug Carrillo, News 3.